Hi, I'm Murray Nemsen, the Industry Development Manager at Australian Mangoes. The Australian mango industry has a new mapping application which is now available on our website. As our industry grows, it is vital we have an accurate representation of the extent of our production. This mapping ensures that industry is able to make informed, data-driven decisions around marketing, water supply, infrastructure and general planning. This map will also help us to better respond to biosecurity threats and natural disasters. For example, in the event of a disease outbreak, industry groups can access the map and know exactly where surrounding crops are located and quickly develop management strategies to help contain the disease. This product can also be used to map floods, fires or cyclones to speed up the process to apply for recovery assistance. To ensure we account for all commercial orchards, we encourage you to review the map. If trees are missing or are misclassified, you can let us know by clicking on the top left corner of the map. You will be redirected to the Australian Tree Crop Survey, where you can follow the instructions to bring this to the attention of the mapping team at the University of New England. The map does not contain any personal or commercial information. I'm on farm with Sam. We've checked the map and noted that these trees haven't been included. So let's complete a survey now. Locate the section on the map where trees are missing. Drop a pin. Select mangoes. Add a comment. Click submit to complete the survey. The mapping team is especially interested in new plantings, which cannot be mapped using satellite imagery alone. They need our help, so please check the map and complete the survey if needed. Thanks for helping us make the map more accurate.